will reach 91 degrees. Right, let's go to Sierra, who is here with today's weather forecast. Hey girls, are you excited? I am. And this is the morning show on CTN. Good morning, Chargers. I'm Savannah Bellum, and this is the morning show on CTN. I'm Cami Sinnott. Today is Thursday, December 10, 2015. There are all there are only eight days of school left until Christmas break, not counting today. Before we go to Alyssa for today's weather forecast, we're going to show you CTN reporter Cami Sinnott. Hey, that's you. Cami Sinnott interviews Mrs. O'Reilly. Hi, I'm Cami Sinnott, and this is five questions for Mrs. O'Reilly. Hi. <laughs> Do you like seeing kids smile every day? Yes, I do. Is the staff very helpful? Yes, the staff is very helpful. We have a good volunteer, a bunch of volunteers that help us every day in the cafeteria, and they're all wonderful. Have you ever worked in a restaurant? I have not worked in a restaurant, but when I was 15, I worked at Pat's Pizza. What made you want to become a cafeteria? Well, I actually did not want to become a, a cafeteria worker. Um, my good friend asked me to help her mother out, who was Mrs. McNally, who ran the program for many years. So I kind of came into it with helping her. And then, unfortunately, Mrs. McNally became sick, so then they asked me to take over the program. So I did. And I have one more daughter left here, and she's in seventh grade. And then we'll see if I'm going to continue after. Do you like any of the menu items? Um, I like the chicken fingers. How about you? Is there anything you like? Yeah, I like the hot dog and mac and cheese. Hot dog and mac and cheese. Great. Thank you. You're welcome. Now we will go to Sierra for today's weather forecast. Greetings from the news, news desk, weather person. is going to be the opposite of your idea of what December feels like. The high for today is going to be a surprising 58 degrees. Tonight it will be partly cloudy and 41 degrees. Tomorrow it's going to be 63. I seriously have no idea when it's going to start to get cold. Back to you at the news desk. Thanks, Sierra. Lunch today is two tacos, courtesy of Uncle Chris. Can I have four? Don't start. Jeez, I just want some. I just want to support Mr. Ford's loving and generous Uncle Chris. Oh, in that case, I want four tacos too. Awesome. <laughs> there are no local celebrities' birthdays today. Celebrities who celebrate their birthdays today are actress Raven Simone from the old Disney show That's So Raven turns thirty, and the poet Emily Dickinson would have turned one hundred and eighty-five. Wow, that's pretty old. Cammy, you know she's not alive, right? Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I'm only eight, you know. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Cammy. It's okay. Attention, student council members. Please listen carefully. The student council meeting will be held today from 12.10 to 12.30 p.m. in the art room. Again, the meeting is from 12.10 to 12.30 p.m. in the art room. You will go to the art room after you eat your lunch. Again, you will go to the art room after you eat your lunch in the cafeteria. Also, we need a lot of help for Dance for a Cure. The smallest things make the biggest difference. Signing up on the school website doesn't take up that much time. Ask, your, ask one of your parents to help you sign up online. This Monday is Spirit Day. Before school, the student council will be selling hot chocolate in the cafeteria for 50 cents per cup. You can get marshmallows and whipped cream on your hot chocolate, too. All proceeds will go to benefit the Andrew McDonough Be Positive Foundation. Also, if you have a Santa hat, student council would like you to wear it on Monday and decorate it for Spirit Day. You could pin some things to it, put stickers on it, really anything to show you're excited for Christmas. Show your school spirit and help out kids with cancer this Monday. Tomorrow is a red and green tag day. It is also the school Christmas bazaar and a half day with noon dismissal. Now, here is Alyssa with today's inspirational quote. Hey, Alyssa.
Hey guys, today's inspirational quote comes from Dr. Seuss's book, The Lorax. He says, unless someone like you cares a whole awful lot, nothing is going to get better. It's not. This goes with the childhood cancer awareness theme because the little things make the difference. Everyone should come together to fight this horrible disease. Be the one to care a whole awful lot. Be the one to make things better. See you later, Chargers. Thanks, Alyssa. We will leave you today with a video of Kid President explaining his holiday gift guide. For Savannah, Sierra, Alyssa, and the rest of our crew, this is Cami Sant wishing you a great Charger Thursday. See you guys tomorrow. It's the holidays! Some people are excited. But for some people, it could be overwhelming. There's so much to do, see, eat. But don't stress! Life is short, and the only can be expensive. I'm here to tell you that it's going to be okay. It's time to give the perfect gift. Perfect gift! <laughs> I wrote that fame song. Do you like it? I got some special people I need to get presents for. My mom, my dog, Beyonce. I can't just give them just anything. You gotta be perfect. How can you tell if the gift that you're giving is gonna be bad? A few questions to ask yourself. Is this a random item that I wrapped up from my house? If it is, it's a bad idea. But keep pressing it, huh? I don't have any money. No problem, you can always make a gift. Like this awesome macaroni picture I made. It's, it's a picture of Uncle Jesse from Full House. Have mercy, perfect gift. This is an old pumpkin from Halloween. I drew a face on it. For good. But the truth is, most people don't need stuff. They need to know somebody cares. It's about spreading love. Things like bear hugs. But don't hug an actual bear because they don't understand hugs. They will rip your face off. Time. Spend some time with the people you love. Life is what happens when you put down your phone. Do something awesome. Maybe you and your friends can get together and give gifts that matter. The perfect gift is something that makes the world better. You can go to a site like inspiredgifts.org. Buy a blanket for kids who need them. Send books to kids who need stories. You can even help with kind. Kids in need of desks. Help provide thousands of school desks. They go to kids in Malawi. For less than $7, you can buy a kid a soccer ball. Plus, make sure they have the nutrition that they need. These aren't gifts that just make you happy. They make the world more awesome. Like, for real, they help save lives. Giving gifts can change the world, especially when they're full of love. You can give a gift in honor of somebody. Who can you get inspired gift for? Your teacher, your parents, your dentist, anybody. As cool as it might be to give macaroni art like this, it's cooler to give a gift that matters. What if everybody gave a gift that made the world a little bit better? Then we would all have a big dance party. Put a gift under somebody else's tree. Go to inspiredgifts.org. I challenge you and your friends to give a gift that matters. Send this video to people who matter to you. Perfect gift! <laughs> Help save children's lives. That's a perfect gift. Peace out. So pancakes.